all right what is going on welcome to the channel all right as promised we've got a special video for you guys here today in this video we are going to be testing out version 13 which is the latest hardware for fsd update which um so check this out we are officially going to test out version 4 we're just going to do a little drive around the block here to show you how it works from the park position so first things first seat belts cell phones away and take a look so some changes wait wait before you even go into park let's let's go back so take a look at this here we've got fsd supervised press and hold and just like that right what what, it, what happened there it went into drive by itself take a look at the way it's turning making a u-turn so here we go this is going to be the first v13 drive wow that was so smooth that was incredibly smooth there was no steering wheel jitter whatsoever that was wow so here we go we are just going up to the sheets real quick of course you know still got to make our gas stop even though we don't have to fill up you know but man take a look at the visualization it looks incredibly smooth i don't know if they did some update here but this has always been a very hard intersection for the car to see it'll like really jitter previous versions actually would hit this curb i've hit the curb a couple times and take a look at the way it hit that right yeah no it, problem right. so it didn't hesitate it was that's as smooth as it's been ever absolutely that felt and incredible we still haven't figured out how it can turn into a you know it always goes to a you light. know what i wonder if you set like a little pin waypoint yeah waypoint could probably do it but it comes to the but this is fine Look we're gonna test it right there yeah so we're nice. testing it comes to the red light here's another red light it's full a turn, stop it's a full stop turn on red no hesitation that that's pretty smooth very nicely done let's see if we can end trip uh-oh no go back let's see if it'll take us back around figure it out from like this exact moment no it's gonna turn into sheets first Oh, but that's what it has on the, the right. map here. So, let's see what it does. So it's never in a done parking this lot. before. It usually, always goes it'll to goes the, around, right. right? But it saw that cars were coming, and this is the yeah. proper way of traffic technically. So, actually, there's arrows there too. So, overall, this is a um, 2023 Model Y perf performance, which is with hardware four. I personally have the Model Three with hardware three so oh look at this it's gonna park it's gonna park it parked in the handicap <laughs> spot but oh no no it knows better it went ahead dude it Back. did that by itself yes that you didn't tell it to reverse no you didn't tell it to park no are you kidding me no but but what but happened to the i thought i put it into so now it says press and hold to go to work <laughs> Wow, okay, so, so it backed let's... into a spot. That was cool. It, that was a handicap. I'm like, nope, can't go there. Right, and it knew that it couldn't park there, so, it, and I, I thought it was parking front end I first. thought it was going to override the last one and go to work, but it finished the current the one. The first drive, which somehow it knew, like it had it stored in the system there. Last time it would go, out, yeah, still going this way. That's the right way, I think, because that's flowing with traffic here. But it, but does it go look internal? at the purple tesla i see that there a lot actually yeah. i think that person might so, work there what we need to test here is which way does it choose what i did notice on oh because you have nothing in the nav in now. the new version oh it's not yeah i don't know why i took it out oh it's gonna the, go left yeah the, I almost no, wanted right. to go no, right it is going right no it was gonna go left first i had to change right, it no right turn signal was on the whole time but anyway Hmm. I did notice that it, it kind of records its path so that on the way back it goes the same way because in my neighborhood it used to cut through it would go like the long way instead of cutting through yeah and now that I've cut through a couple times a couple times now another doesn't go the long way anymore I almost think too like with all the Teslas I see maybe in the that's the AI part they put into it it's oh learning absolutely plus think about all the other cars that are collecting that data so then 
it just has it all mapped out. And, so and the speed bumps are, over time. This didn't used to catch speed bumps very good at all. I remember it went over it, it, it a couple it, it, times. It, it, I have some videos in this exact spot. Yeah, so yes. that, that's so things in the in the road in the way it's got a lot better like it sees that speed bump there look at it slowing down to the point of crawling perfect it. yeah you wouldn't have done that any differently no honestly. and it would have never when you and i first started doing these videos yeah it went over pretty hard absolutely i almost scraped the bottom of my car a couple times <laughs> yeah. with that just flying over them so, but so when it comes to true autonomous driving it has to know what the road has to offer and it's done a lot better i've seen some scenarios where there's some the road. items on the road too yeah and where it'll it, go out of the way it'll show like a little gray smudge sometimes but now i wouldn't count on that to do it every time of course hardware 4 is going to have better cameras so it might have more of a visibility to see the but ground the, from stop to start at a stop sign and red light is a hundred percent better than it was yeah and the way it approaches right stop signs and yes it, it doesn't Slow. It doesn't slow down 10, 20 feet. Yeah. It goes up like you would. And let's test it from the stop point, how long it takes for it to actually start and, and there's no. this is where your car jitters like crazy. Yeah, let's, no, no, seriously, the jitter on this turn yes. is ridiculous. Right. So let, let's take a look at the way this version Thanks 13. Not. It goes right No out. jitter, look how smooth that is. Wow. Wow. It knows that that's a bike lane now. I gotta ask real quick, when did that happen? Oh, that was like in the first four weeks though in the car. Oh my god, that's the same one? Yeah, they oh, filled okay. it. Yeah, I remember. Oh, okay, sorry. So, hey, that, <laughs> that's something I got to mention. You know, it's happened to my car once or twice too. So we're coming in back into the parking lot. And let's see what it does if, here. Is it going to go well, ahead it's, and... it's not going to park because I haven't... It's just going to go to where it thinks the this, address stops. Which is what a robo taxi really should do is drop you off at the front. But now look, it's going to actually circle around the building interesting and, and then it just picked a random place to stop now keep in mind this is an fsd trial he actually received this as a christmas gift yes it, and uh just woke up christmas morning fsd was on installed on his car didn't have to do anything so yeah that that means that hopefully hardware 3 should be getting end-to-end -end version 13 by the first week in the new year hopefully and um, make sure you subscribe because I will be uploading a ton of videos with um, pretty much every scenario tested. That was so smooth. Yeah. My car takes so long doing that turn. Yeah. That was incredibly smooth. Right. I mean, you're you're noticing some major differences like like that. Like. Yeah. Yeah. You know. It's night and day when it comes to that. And, and I'm on the hurry mode. Oh, so. that's another thing I didn't really. Yeah. We'll, we'll get a chance we'll, to mess we'll around. We'll add with that too much. into the next video. Let's, of what the difference is between hurry. Let's do an auto park here to end, end the video. I know you're not the biggest fan of auto park, but you know we're at a point where let's see how long it takes. I think you just gotta let go of the brake. Uh oh. Park assist is degraded. What is that? <laughs> camera yeah, obstructed what's going on did you not <laughs> clean your cameras <laughs> maybe not oh wow look at yeah. that you can see it's probably because of the sun but you know what you might have something on this camera you might just want to <laughs> well it needs to be washed clean but, off real quick but, yeah hey you guys are in for a treat with this new version but we'll do another video with the uh hurry up mode and what the differences are there absolutely i mean take a look and you know see what your commute is like so in the next week i'll get an update so you can tell me what it's been like yeah, you know exactly hopefully i get it here soon too with hardware three trust me i've been trying to push that online so hopefully tesla knows and they're going to send it out thank you guys again for watching this video hopefully you enjoyed it hit that like button if you did and subscribe for more have a great day